Okay, we'll finish up today with uh, tight end Travis Bokalek. Um, first question I have, uh, Sean Callahan, Husker Online. Yeah, Travis, just um, talk about for you how long this has been for you to get to this point after sitting out and, and how ready are you now to get on the field for Nebraska? Yeah, um, you know, it's, it's been a long time. Uh, what, almost two years um, since I've stepped foot on a uh, football field, actually, in a game. Um, and uh, so, you know, it, it means a lot to finally be able to get out there with the guys and, um, you know, take on Ohio State. Uh, Mitch Sherman, The Athletic. Hey, Travis, um, what are your expectations for uh, the tight end position this year? Not just yourself, but um, th that group. Uh, yeah, I mean, we've got a lot of high expectations in that group. Um, you know, we're a veteran room, um, a lot of older guys out there, you know. Um, we're, we're trying to be the leaders on the field. Um, and, uh, you know, we're going to use our tight ends um, pretty significantly. And, uh, you know, I think we're going to go out there and make plays. Um, but, you know, I, I think really we just want to want to be leaders um, and be vocal leaders and lead by example out there. So. Uh, Lincoln Journal star, Parker Gabriel. <clears throat> Hey, Travis, we were talking to Jack Stoll uh, last week, I think, and he mentioned the progress that you've made um, as a blocker over the course of your time here. I guess, could you maybe measure for us where you were in that department when you got to Nebraska and, and where you think you are at now? Uh, yeah, I think I've improved uh, a great amount. Um, you know, Coach Beck has done a great job, um, Coach DeMeo, uh, with our, uh, you know, our footwork um, and our technique. So um, I think we've improved a lot uh, over the past uh, couple of years, or I guess past year um, when I first got here. <clears throat> and when, when, when you're talking about blocking, I mean, how much of it is technique based for you and, and how much have you learned in that regard, I guess? Um, uh, I've learned here? so much. Um, you know, I think it's all technique. It's all about footwork and hands um, and then driving. So um, Coach Beck has done a great job um, uh, helping me with that. Michael Brunts, 24-7 Sports. Travis, uh, last year and, and kind of sitting out, I guess, what did you learn uh, aside from just the, the blocking stuff that you've already kind of hit on that uh, maybe you feel like you've improved on? And I guess, is there also maybe a mental gains to be made from, from sitting out and kind of having to, to watch things uh, and, and be on the scout team too? Um, yeah, I think when I first got here, um, no one I was going to have to sit out uh, one of my, you know, one of my goals was to really learn a lot over that year and not waste that year down on the scout team. Um, so I was uh, still doing the drills uh, with footwork and stuff, um, real, really working on that blocking um, and then route running as well. Um, just the cuts. Um, and, uh, you know, I think I learned a lot um, over the year or over the past year um, and gained a lot from it. So. Omaha World Herald, Sam McEwen. Hey Travis, I know that I know that you've worked on your blocking a lot and technique and things like that. When they signed you, though, I, I got this sense that they were signing you in part for the things that you already did well. Um, based on you know analyzing your own game, what, what do you think you do well, and what do you think you can bring to Nebraska's pass game as a as a target downfield? Um, you know, I think overall our room, uh, just in general, has great size. Um, and I think, you know, we're big targets, uh, can be used in the red zone, um, throw it up there, we'll get it. And then, uh, I mean, like you mentioned, um, you know, our blocking. Um, so I think that those are two things that we do really well. How much How more much of a more factor of do you think the tight ends will be in the red zone this season? They didn't, they didn't get a, a lot of targets last year. Um, I mean, hopefully a lot. Uh, I, hope, I hope we're a big factor um, and, uh, you know, uh, the quarterbacks utilize us and our, and our size and uh, we take advantage of that, so. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Hale Varsity, Derek Peterson. Hey, Travis. Um, not necessarily a question about you specifically, but more on the special teams. When you guys are working on special teams in practice, how often are, are, are starters or, or second string guys involved in special teams? And what kind of emphasis have the coaches put on it in practice? Uh, you know, we've got um, what, two or three deep uh, going through special teams. Um, so, you know, the coaches really want us, uh, you, you know, want guys who are me playing to be on special teams as well. Um, so, yeah, hopefully that answers your question.
Yeah, any other questions for <clears throat> for Travis? Open it up. Otherwise, we'll wrap up. Um, okay, last one. Uh, Parker Gabriel, Lincoln Journal Star. Hey, Travis, being that you started your career uh, in the in the Big Ten East, I know most of your teammates have played uh, in Columbus too, but what do you anticipate um, about going to Ohio State? And is it going to be weird to have it be, to not have there be 104,000 or whatever people there? Uh, yeah, I mean, it'll be, it'll be a little weird. Um, but, you know, like we're going to go in there focused on the game, not worrying about the fans. Um, so I think, I think we'll be fine. All right. Thank you, Travis. Thanks, everyone, for jumping on. Um, we will have Coach Frost briefly on Thursday, and I'll get you details on that. Thank you.